Hi, my name is Jennifer and I'm a library assistant at the North Columbus Public Library. What comes up must come down. When we send astronauts into space, we want to make sure that they have a safe way to come back down to Earth. And what was NASA's answer? The parachute! So today, we're going to do a craft where you build your own space shuttle with a parachute. So, what you're going to need for today is a Dixie cup, embroidery floss, or yarn, or fishing twine, any sort of a small string, a grocery store plastic bag, and a pair of scissors. So, the first thing we're going to do is make our parachute canopy, which is this fabric part, up top. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your plastic bag and you're going to cut out so you have a square. Once you have your square, you're going to take it, you're going to fold it in half, and then in half again. So you have a smaller square. And you're going to take your scissors and you're going to cut from the open end to the other open end, you're going to cut from point, kind of up in an arc, to the other point. And then when you unfold it, you will have a pretty even circle. So once you have that, you're going to take your circle, you're going to poke four holes into it, and you're going to cut four even strings and tie the strings to each of those holes. Once you've got that done, you'll take the strings, even them up, take all the ends, and bring them all together. So you have it like this, and then you'll make just a regular knot in the top of your string. There! It's already looking like a parachute. So now you'll take your Dixie cup, you'll take your scissors, and be careful or have an adult help you, but you'll turn it upside down and poke a hole in the top, right in the middle. Once you've done that, You'll take your knot from the string and you'll put it right into that hole and then grab it from the other side. Oh, I almost forgot. You also need a small piece of tape. So you'll take your tape and you'll tape your knot to the inside of the cup. That way your parachute can't come out and your astronaut can land safely. Alright, once you've got all that taped down, then your space shuttle is complete. Now feel free to decorate it. You can paint your Dixie cup or use Sharpie or markers to draw on it. And I also encourage you to try different kinds of parachutes. Maybe try a square-shaped parachute, or a heart-shaped parachute, or you can try adding more strings and seeing what happens. But then when you're all done, you can kind of pinch it at the top, and you can test it out to see if it works. There you have it, your very own space shuttle. We are springing into summer learning at the Chattahoochee Valley Libraries, and the program you just attended is one of the ways you can earn completions. Just go to cvlga.org and look for Spring into Summer Learning. You can register yourself and your family online, and then start reading and attending our online events. That's all you have to do. We're giving away weekly gift certificates, and every completion you make enters you into a grand prize drawing for tablets, games, gifts, and more. Remember, you have to register to win, cvlga.org, and we'll see you online again real soon.